Hello, so uh, we need a little bit more space for our babies, our plant starts. So I put another bench in at the back of the uh, Tiki Tunnel. Uh, 10 foot by 16 foot by 7.5 foot tall trampoline frame, recycled trampoline frame. Tiki Tunnel, I'll show you. And there it is. So that's the new bench that's gone in. Uh, put two more water up trays in there. <laughs> and I've transferred the stuff that needs it to be a little bit cooler up to this top end where it's better ventilated. Those carrots are coming on nicely there, you can see. I think the roots will be getting settled down from the courgettes. But they'll be in here for about another week or so just to get the roots on them. This stuff needs to go out. All the brassicas and leafy greens, I've got to get these out. But the trouble is, it's the time restrictions. I move the tomatoes there to the middle. They're going to be potted on into big pots uh, tomorrow. I've got some sage and parsley there I need to do something with as well. Those are the seeds from our friends. Obviously, that was only a day or two ago that we put those in and started those off. But, um, yeah, that should be about a week, that week to ten days. This stuff is going out. This is going to have to go out tomorrow. What you're seeing here with the yellowing off of the basal leaves, those are the first leaves that start on the plant. And when they're yellowing off like that, that that's the plant telling me, I want me on bed. Put me outside. I'm getting too big in here. I need to grow. So these are going to be, I'm moving them towards the door. So when they're at the door, they're, look at those peas. They're going to have to go out as well, definitely. But I've got a place for them. I'm going to have to sort it out for tomorrow. So that's going to have to be weeded and sorted out. And they're going to be planted into the... The peas did okay in there last year. So that's, uh, that's where we're putting them again this year. But yeah, time restrictions. We have time restrictions. Which is not good. That's a courgette. We'll put, up, put him up here with the tomatoes. I'll have to get some uh, vermiculite on, on him as well after. But yeah, the time is up. I got down here at uh, quarter to nine. It's quarter past ten now. So I'm going to have to get off. Um, yeah. I'll spend all day down here, you know that, but... Uh, Whatever. So yeah, right. I'll. Uh, I'm gonna get off now. Have a great day. It's a beautiful sunny day down here. There isn't a cloud in the sky. No airplanes flying about. The weather. The skies are beautifully clear. Absolutely beautifully clear. I love it down here. I mean, this is the place you need to be. This is, the, this is the safest, most healthy place to be at the moment. So anyway, yeah, we'll get off. All right. Take care, everybody. If I don't see you through the week, I'll see you through the window. This is Guru Mifinda signing out. But first, I'll show you um, the brassicas from yesterday that we planted in, the thriving. Yeah, the thriving, look. Love it in there, then. What I am going to do, I think, next time is I'm going to get some of the black netting because the black netting is practically see-through. You can't see it once you put, once you put the black uh, bug netting on, scaffold debris netting. You can see through it. But yeah, there's the uh, there's the collars, the double collars, sheep's wool around them. I mean, I know it's only day one; it's only the day after we put we put them in, like. But uh, I like that. I think it's cool. Blue skies smiling on me. Nothing but blue skies do I see. Ta-da, everybody.